Konnichiwa YouTubers, this is Red Stock Straight from Point Magoo, California. Today we're going to do a video review of Jetfire and Jetstorm. This is actually a two-part review. We're going to form them into safeguard next. I have them in this little post because they actually can connect, uh, which no jet that I have ever worked on can do. But hey, it looks cool and it's easy to connect. You have the little tabs over here. All you have to do is just pop them in and really don't hold too wet together too well but it is what it is let's take a look at both um, a really flimsy attempt at a well jet let's look at the blue one because it contrasts better with the white <laughs> yeah there's a rhyme to my reason here as you can see beautiful little light piping you can see that but of course uh, undercarriage I don't know where the pilot's supposed to sit if there's like no seat but then again these things fly by themselves so uh, yeah the cockpit nose cone uh yeah it's a flimsy excuse for a jet okay i know that the the more awesome modes are going to be safeguard and the robot mode so it's going to take some points but it has great light piping i just like it i like the blue the gold the coloring is pretty good the molding still not existing but at least they got some are very limited uh trademark of the animated line as you can see elite guard so you got that symbol sparse low paint but man uh, just the translucent pits just make it uh, but uh, average at best five out of ten made back back 2009 or eight is it yeah by hasbro and takata tomi made in china has a stamp there for some reason don't know why yeah okay well that's one of them i'll show you <laughs> jet fire and there we go I think uh, the colors are so cooler on this guy you got that cream color eggshell white whatever you want to call it off-white I like the orange I like the translucent uh, I like the amber so there's a cockpit reminds me of dang what are those fighters from Star Wars okay easy enough so they got the dude let's go with the blue dude jet storm Transformation relatively easy. Uh, as you can see, just a fold out. He's pretty much a fold out fighter. Hopefully, I don't break anything trying to transform him. So, we're going to move these legs out just a tiny bit. There we go. All right. All right. So, I'm going to split this. These are going to become the arms. And just, okay, so that splits apart. Move this back. Perfect. We're gonna move chest piece down and the head. Cool. Then this can move down. And it's a cockpit, moves down, arms with it. So we're going to gently move the legs. And you have to be gentle because these scorp pieces don't fall off or do fall off. No painting on the abdomen, so you're gonna get points off. Gonna rotate the legs 90 degrees again simple transformation does have a heel spur no you don't I'm surprised no heel spur oh well awesome gonna tab that in I'm gonna tab the shoulders so I like the fact that they got tabs there's this little tab over here that tabs here and we're just gonna rotate the arms 90 degrees, rotate the hands, 90 degrees. And then we're gonna move that up, and you gotta be careful. It has a socket joint here for a shoulder. And I gotta be careful because this sucker likes to pop off. There we go, easy. Sometimes you just gotta be gentle. Ball joint, the head isn't in a ball joint, it's on a swivel. Well, we got it. Let me show you. Beautiful light piping. There we go. I like the head sculpt. Very, very blue. <laughs> Detailed. Has a smirk. I wonder if the other dude has that probably show it in the next video so there we go 
So as far as articulation, you got the ball joint on the shoulder, you know, bicep swivel, single joint on the elbow. So, and kind of a swivel, and the molded hand, mm, not great, doesn't come with any weapons. I like that translucent chest piece. No paint apps. Okay, the skirt pieces do attach. Has a little bit of articulation on the hips. Swivel on the thigh, single jointed knee, so very rudimentary figure for deluxe. All right, there we go. So that's good old Jetstorm. Wish he had some heel spurs, but oh, he does. Good, helps. Trust me, you'll need that when you do a little transformation with the guy. Okay. Okay, so there's a size comparison with Megatron. So you see, you can see he is a deluxe figure. And while I'm uh, doing this, I'm just going to transform good old Jetfire, my favorite. So we can go ahead and show you how he looks. And the skirt pieces are going to fall off, so I'm not going to even bother putting that back together again. I'm only going to make... Oh, wonderful thing I forgot to mention is that... See, the shoulders do tab in. They have that little tab over there. Pull that up. Okay. I like the... Jetfire is cooler simply because... Look at that. He's got aviator goggles, and he has wonderful light piping. Uh, get it better light so yeah he's just cooler look at the guy the orange the red it just man he, he, and the aviator goggles and the little flame head piece it just makes him a cooler guy all together so there is Jetfire aptly named more badass and deluxe sized. All right, YouTubers, that's all I got. I'll say a six out of ten. I, I really like this guy much better than the other guy. He just has much more personality. Look at the guy; still has that smirk going to the other side, but he just looks cooler. Six and a half for freaking jet fire. Six four jet storm for being just uh, plain. All right, that's all I got, YouTubers, and I catch y'all next time.